Yo, what is going on guys? In this video, I'm going to be showing you two of the best methods on how you can get the white joggers in GTA 5 Online after the latest patch. The methods do not require net cuts, so you do not need two consoles, plus you can do this on any platform like PlayStation, Xbox and PC, and also old gen or new gen. But before we get into that, if you do want to enter our 14,000 subscriber shortcut giveaway, then all you gotta do is drop a like, subscribe to the channel and then comment the word giveaway and you'll be entered into that. But without wasting any more time, let's just get straight into the video. Alright, so for the first method, I'm going to show you how you can get the white joggers for the female character. So if you don't want to know how to get them on the male character, just skip to this timestamp on the screen right here. But yeah, to start off with the female joggers, you want to start any online session and you want to head to any clothing store. And now you're going to want to save the outfit that you want to keep. And then you're going to want to delete all of your saved outfits, as it's actually going to be the transfer glitch. Once you have done that, now jump into the pause menu, go to online and go to swap character. If you guys don't want to have to spend hours grinding out these glitches, be sure to check out the instant delivery modded accounts from MitchCactus.com, which is available for Xbox, PlayStation and PC. That comes with between 50 million to 1 billion dollars, as well as RP level 100 and more. They also offer account boost, meaning that an existing account of yours can have money or RP added to it. These guys have over 4,500 reviews on their official Trustpilot page and are by far the most highly reputable models. There will be a link in the pinned comment and description and be sure to use code AVADE for 5% off. From here you should see your main female character on the left slot and you should have a new open slot on the right. Shoot on to select the character on the right. Now just make sure the gender is set to male, then just save continue, call it whatever you want and load into an online session. Now just open up your pause menu and make sure you can see the clothing stores. So if you can't, all you want to do is just find a new invite only session, and then you're going to want to head over to any of them. Once you arrive, to start you want to come over to the accessories section and you're going to want to take off all of your accessories so anything you have equipped there, just take it all off. Next, come over to the top section and you're also going to want to take off all of the tops like the jacket and the shirt. Then come over to the shoe section and take off your shoes. Now finally, come over to the pants section, head into shorts. Then come down to number 36 which is the tan stripe boxer shorts as this is actually going to give you the white joggers. Yeah, just equip these and now we should only have these equipped. Then you can just come up to the front desk and save this outfit in any slot. And once you've done that now, just open up the interaction menu and take the easy way out. Once we're back, just open up your pause menu, go to online and start up creator. From here select create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert. Now to open up your pause menu, go to online and go to choose character. From here once again choose your main female on the left and you should see the character we were just making on the right. But yeah you should want to delete the character on the right when we were just making the outfit on. Once you have deleted the character, now just click B or circle to go back to story mode. Now if you are on next gen, you're not actually going to have this option, so I'll leave a video link in the description on how you can get a workaround for this. But yeah, once in story mode, now just start up an invite only session. Now just come into any clothing store once we're in an online session and now you can save the outfit that you wanted to keep. Now also there you're going to see the white joggers outfit and as you can see it now has the white joggers. Plus it comes with the invisible ankles as well. So now you can just come change the shoes, top and make some cool outfits with this. 
be that's it for this method, but anyway, let's go on with the second method on how you can get the white joggers for the male character. Alright, so now I'm going to show you how you can get the white joggers for the male character. So to get started, you want to come over to any clothing store and you're going to want to equip the outfit that you don't want to lose and save all of your saved outfits. As this is again going to be a transfer glitch. But yeah, once you've done that, now sort of hit your pause menu, go to online and go to swap character. From here, just like the last method, you should see your main male character on the left and you should have a new open slot on the right. You just want to select the character on the right. Now just make sure the gender is set to female, then just save continue, call it whatever you want and load it to an online session. Once in an online session, open up your map and you're going to want to make sure you can see the clothing stores. So if you can't, all you're going to do is find a new invite only session and then you're going to want to head over to any of them. Now to get started, come over to the accessories section and take off all of the accessories. So like earrings and anything like that, just take it all off. Next, come over to the pants section and go into sport pants and you want to keep the first one the spotted muscle pants. Next, come over to the shoe section. Then come into the high heel boots and you're going to equip the deluxe midnight combat boots number 24. And then you're going to want to save this outfit in slot number 2, and this is for the all white sports shoes that look like this, as you can see these are going to be the shoes you're going to get if you choose these. But yeah, now just come into the boots, and come down to number 45 which is the crimson cowboy boots, as this is what's going to give you the invisible ankles. So yeah, if you do want the white jogs with the infant's ankles, you're going to save this into slot number 3 as well. But yeah, once you have done that, just make sure they're all saved. And now what we're going to do is just take the easy way out through the interaction menu. Once you spawn back in, now to your pause menu, go to online and start up creator. From here, select create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert. Now just open up your pause menu, go to online and go to choose character. Now on this screen you're going to delete the female character that we were just creating on the right, so yeah just delete that character. Now from here just click B or circle to go back to story mode. If you're on next gen you're not going to have this option, I'll leave a video in the description on how you can get a workaround for this. But yeah, once it's story mode, now just load up an invite only session. Once we load in, just come into any clothing store and you're going to save the outfit that you want us to keep into slot number 20. Now just come into the standard outfits and equip the first one right here. Next, come over to the pants section, head into the cargo pants. And you're going to equip the light grey large cargoes. So they're actually white joggers, but they just call them this, so you should, yeah, you should want to equip these. Then come over to the shoes, go into boots, and you're going to equip any of the boots that tuck in the joggers. 
For example, I'm just going to use these blue loggers. Once we've done that, come over to the top section and take off the top. Next, open up your interaction menu, go to style and also take off your glasses. And now what you're going to do, you're going to want to bookmark the job which will be linked in the description. So down there I'll have a job link, it's going to be called It's AG Thing and you're going to want to bookmark it for all consoles. Yeah, once you've done that now you can just restart your game, come back in. Now just open up your pause menu, go to online, jobs, play job, go to bookmarks, then come down to missions and you're going to start it right here called It's AG Thing. Now right here, set the clothing to player saved outfits and then you can just confirm the settings, invite anyone or wait for a random and then start up the job. Now on the screen right here, you're going to scroll one or two to the right depending on which shoes you want. So you're going to scroll one to the right if you want the white sports shoes and two to the right if you want the inverse ankles like I do. Yeah, once you spawn out as you can see, now we have the white joggers with the invisible ankles or the sports shoes, whichever one you chose. And now you just want to come over to your apartment. Now it's going to pop up on the map, so you do need to remember where it is. Yeah, once we're here, now you can just save this outfit as slot number one. And then you can simply just leave the job through your phone. And once we come back into an online session, now just open the interaction menu, go to style and equip that outfit that we just saved. And then the top is going to reappear and there you go, you now have the white joggers with the invisible ankles. Now it is to be noted that these are actually the fake white joggers. However, it is the best method to get the white joggers without using two consoles, so yeah. But yeah, they were two of the best methods on how you can get the white joggers in GTA 5 Online for all consoles, so I hope you guys did enjoy. Do be sure to drop a like and subscribe, but anyway, I'll see you in the next one.